Hello everyone and welcome to All Saints Church in Collingham. Today is the second Sunday in Advent. It's our normal Sunday for noisy worship and Chris Dingle will happen here today live. So we're having a filmed small Chris Dingle service and Holy Communion today. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The first thing we do on an Advent Sunday is to light the Advent candles. So I'm taking the light from our Easter candle. And lighting two of our Advent candles. So for the first candle, we remember the patriarchs, Abraham, Isaac and Jacob. For the second candle, we remember the prophets. And we pray. Lord Jesus, light of the world, the prophet said you would bring peace and save your people in trouble. Give peace in our hearts at Christmas and show all the world God's love. Amen. Amen. Heavenly Father, you call us to repent of our sins, soften our proud and stubborn hearts, Lord, have mercy. Lord, Lord have, have mercy. mercy. Lord Jesus, you declared the forgiveness of God. Teach us to forgive one another. Christ, have mercy. Christ, Christ have, have mercy. mercy. Holy Spirit, you search our hearts and show us the truth. Direct us in your way of righteousness. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Almighty God, who in Jesus Christ has given us a kingdom that cannot be destroyed, forgive us our sins. Open our eyes to God's truth. Strengthen us to do God's will and give us the joy of his kingdom through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty God, purify our hearts and minds that when your Son Jesus Christ comes again as Judge and Saviour, we may be ready to receive him, who is our Lord and our God. Amen. Keith and Pat are now going to tell us the story of the beginnings of our Christmas story. So, Pat and Keith. Hear the Gospel of our Lord Jesus Christ according to Luke. Glory to you, you O Lord. Lord. In the sixth month, God sent the angel Gabriel to Nazareth, a town in Galilee, to a virgin pledged to be married to a man named Joseph, a descendant of David. The virgin's name was Mary, and the angel went to her. Greetings, you are highly favoured. The Lord is with you. Mary was greatly troubled at his words and wondered what kind of greeting this might be. Do not be afraid, Mary. You have found favour with God. You will be with child and give birth to a son. And you are to give him the name Jesus. And he will be great and he will be called the Son of the Most High. 
the Lord God will give him the throne of his father David, and he will reign over the house of Jacob forever. His kingdom will never end. Mary asked the angel, How will this be, since I am a virgin? The Holy Spirit will come upon you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. So the Holy One will be born, and he will be called the Son of God. Even Elizabeth, your relative, is going to have a child in her old age. And she, who was said to be barren, is in her sixth month. For nothing is impossible with God. Mary answered, I am the Lord's servant. May it be to me as you have said. Then the angel left her. This is the word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thank you, Pat and Keith, for that beautiful story. What a wonderful story. What a wonderful gift. And now we're going to think about our Christingle, which tells us of God's gifts to us. So we begin with an orange which is round, like the world. It the world is God's gifts to us, all the people in it, all the beauty of the world. And we have four cocktail sticks with sweets and fruit. And they represent the four seasons spring, summer, autumn and winter, with all the change and beauty that they bring. And that reminder, reminds us that as the world turns and the seasons change, everything is right and provided for all our food to grow. We need every one of those seasons and all the different types of weather. And around it, we have a red ribbon, a red ribbon reminding us of the life and the death of Jesus, reminding us that he held nothing back in his love for us, but gave his whole life. Whatever he did, he was living for others. Its round ribbon is round the orange, it reminds me a ribbon around a gift, reminding us that Jesus is God's gift at Christmas and always. And I'm going to light the candle. The candle at the centre of the Christingle reminds us of Jesus the light of the world, showing us how to live, showing us where we need to change, and showing us the way to God. Jesus, the light of the world, at the, in the middle of our world, telling us, so the Christingle tells us the story of Christmas. It tells us the story of God's love for us. And now Anne is going to tell us that in verse. So Anne. So I have some verses about the Christingle, and I also have my bells, and other people do too. So uh, I'm going to say the verses, and then we're all going to accompany the choruses, which I shall also say. So, the world is just round, like the oranges we found. The world is just round, like the oranges we found. Christmas bells jingle, now we've made our Christingle. Christmas bells jingle, now we've made our Christingle. 
Red ribbons remind us that Jesus is near us. Red ribbons remind us that Jesus is near us. Christmas bells ring. <laughs> Christmas bells jingle. Now we've made our Christmas Raisins are sweet and delicious to eat. Raisins are sweet and delicious to eat. Christmas bells jingle. Now we've made our Christmas jingle. Oranges and candles and sweeties on sticks. Oranges and candles and sweeties on sticks. Christmas bells jingle. Now we've made our Christmas jingle. Candles burn bright, for Christ is our light. Candles burn bright, for Christ is our light. Christmas bells jingle, now we made our Christmas jingle. Thank you, Anne, and thank you to our bell ringers there. Well done. Maybe at home you might like to join in when you hear that. So now let us declare our faith in God. We believe in God the Father, from whom every family in heaven and on earth is named. We believe in God the Son, who lives in our hearts through faith and fills us with his love. We believe in God, the Holy Spirit, who strengthens us with power from on high. We believe in one God, Father, Son and Holy Spirit. Amen. We're now going to pray our prayers. The Christingle orange represents the world. We pray for our world, that men, women and children will be able to live together in peace, with food and drink, with homes and everything they need for life. And we pray that they will live in peace and there will be no more wars. We pray especially for children who are sad and lonely in our world and for all refugees. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The red ribbon reminds us of Good Friday when Jesus died at Easter time. We pray that you will bring an end to suffering and that people all over the world will be able to live freely without fear of punishment for their beliefs or their lifestyle. O oh God, bring healing to those who suffer in body, mind and spirit. Comfort those who are sad because someone they love has died and provide for orphaned children. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The cocktail sticks remind us of the four seasons, spring, summer, autumn and winter. We love the autumn colours, the cold of winter when seeds germinate, the new life of spring and the warmth and the rest of summer. Thank you, God for your world. Help us to take care of it and enjoy each season. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The sweets and dried fruit on the cocktail sticks remind us of the food we have, gifts from God who made the world. Thank you for the sun and the rain, the warmth and the heat, which make fruit and crops grow. Bring help to families where harvests have failed or been spoilt, and those who will go hungry this Christmas. 
Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. Jesus Christ is the light of the world, a light no darkness can quench. We remember before God those who have died, and remember that our Advent and Christmas candles remind us of the light of Christ, which always shines and can never be put out. We remember those who we love and see no longer, and we pray that they will live forever in God's light. Lord, in your mercy, hear our prayer. The first part of our service is complete, so stay safe, stay well, and God bless you.